Hello everyone. Today we will talk about a simple project using ESP32 and the Walkwe uh, simulate, simulator. Uh, basically the project will be a button. When you press the button, you're turning the LED off and on like this. The code can be uh, taken from the ESP. If you go to espblockly.com slash button or just select the button LED example, you'll have the, uh, the full page explaining the buttons, what are the buttons, explaining what is the LED, and a very simple schematic diagram of the project we are building. And this is a breadboard connection of the project. So what you do is to copy the code Go, go to the main page of Wokwe, select the ESP32, select all and paste your code, and now start building the, uh, uh, the project. Basically, press on adding new components. You'll be adding LED, you'll be adding push buttons and also you need to add a resistor to know what are our, our, or how to connect it you need to look at the initials of the hardware here the button pin is connected to D2 so look for D2 which is here and then click on it start dragging like this when you reach a corner that you would like to have just click and then keep going then click here so you 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 connected one side of the switch to D2 now what you need to do also is connect the ground to the second side of the button like this Need to move the component delete this one just click on it to delete it so I'll do that again oh sorry this one this is ground so I'll click here and then add the ground so the wire goes goes like this just uh, watch out the the the, the switch has two buttons so you need to connect on the upper side and the other pins in the lower side either this or this side now we're going to the LED the LED is connected to pin uh, 21 the positive side of it so what we need to do is look for 21 okay and then we connect the positive side, which is this side. The way I know that the positive side is this side, I'll try to zoom in, zoom in so you guys can watch it. Okay, as you can see, this side is uh, like the negative side from the way the LED is structured or built. Okay, we have this as the negative side and this one is the positive side. Okay, the, so the current will flow from the pin to the LED, then to the button, uh, to the uh, resistor, like this, then flows back to the ground, which is also connected to the same pin here. So this one is connected also to the ground. Okay, again, I will do that again. Now I'm done. My code. This is my code. This is my connection. So what I need to do now is to simulate. Just press simulate, and the whole thing will be will start running. When I press, I turn it off. When I leave my hand, it's on. 
press leave press leave I can do some also small modifications I'll stop and do this as low okay and this will be high and now let's check how the effect of the code will reflect on the simulation okay now it's started when I press it's on when I leave it's off press and press press so this is all for this project I hope that uh, everyone can do the project and uh, good luck guys